Amid the hum of modern machinery and the glow of neon cities, one of the world's oldest materials continues to weave its quiet legacy silk. For over 5,000 years, China has nurtured this remarkable craft, transforming delicate fibers spun by silkworms into fabrics of luxury art and identity. Today, silk is no longer just a symbol of ancient elegance. It has become the heart of a bio-industry where nature's ingenuity meets human precision. From the rural farms of Sichuan to the high-tech textile factories of Suzhou, billions of silkworms work silently producing more than 60,000 tons of raw silk every year. Each shimmering strand tells a story of patience, science, and artistry. A story that begins with a single mulberry leaf. Silkworms, scientifically known as Bombyx mori, have been domesticated for thousands of years. Their entire existence now intertwined with human care. Each tiny creature barely the size of a matchstick when born will consume up to 25,000 times its weight in mulberry leaves and spin a silk thread over a kilometer long. Modern silkworm farms in China operate like living laboratories. Inside vast facilities spanning tens of thousands of square meters temperature and humidity are precisely controlled usually around 25 degrees and 80% humidity. Automated ventilation fans, sterilized floors, and digital monitoring systems ensure a stable, disease-free environment. Rows of rearing trays fill the rooms, each tray holding hundreds of larvae. Workers and machines work in harmony feeding the worms four to five times a day with freshly harvested mulberry leaves. These leaves are the lifeblood of the silk industry, carefully grown in plantations right next to the farms. Mulberry cultivation itself follows scientific precision. Only leaves from the middle of each branch where nutrients are most concentrated are used. Farmers gently air dry them to remove moisture since silkworms never drink water and are extremely sensitive to dampness. Under soft, diffused light, the rearing halls are filled with the faint rustle of millions of mouths feeding a rhythm as delicate as rain on grass. For about 25 days, this quiet cycle continues until the silkworms, now plump and translucent, are ready for their miraculous transformation. When the silkworms reach full maturity, the entire facility enters its most crucial stage.
each worm begins to spin its cocoon, moving its head in a slow figure eight motion. The liquid silk it secretes instantly solidifies into a filament thinner than human hair, but stronger than steel by weight. Over 48 to 72 hours, billions of tiny creatures weave dense white cocoons that gleam like pearls under the soft light. On traditional farms, bamboo trays are still used as spinning frames, simple yet effective structures that allow each silkworm enough space to form its cocoon. Once spinning is complete, farmers begin harvesting. Each frame is carefully inspected to ensure proper moisture and firmness. In the past, this was all done by hand, a meticulous process that could take days. Today, semi-automatic separators powered by vibration and gentle air pressure can process tens of thousands of cocoons within minutes, increasing efficiency tenfold while minimizing fiber damage. Every season, a single farm can collect millions of cocoons, each no larger than a fingertip, yet collectively forming the foundation of an industry that defines luxury and culture alike. Once harvested, the cocoons are sorted by quality. Skilled workers examine each one for color shape and shell thickness. Only those with perfect luster and uniform texture are chosen for high-grade silk. Next comes heat treatment, a delicate balance of science and tradition. The cocoons are steamed or immersed in hot water between 85-95 degrees to stop metamorphosis sterilized bacteria and soften the outer saracen coating that holds the fibers together. This process ensures the silk filaments remain continuous and strong. Then in long rows of warm basins, the softened cocoons are gently stirred in water around 70 to 90 degrees. Workers search for the loose end of each filament, a nearly invisible thread, only 10 microns thick. Once found, it's carefully guided into an automated reeling machine, where threads from five to 10 cocoons are unwound and combined. The machines spin with rhythmic precision, drawing the fine silk at up to 300 meters per minute. Each cocoon yields about 1,000 meters of filament, 
and roughly 5,000 cocoons are needed to produce just one kilogram of raw silk. The reeling process transforms fragile cocoons into gleaming strands, a river of liquid light that flows through the factory floor. From reeling rooms, the raw silk is transferred to spinning machines. Here, thousands of threads twist and bind together in perfect symmetry, spindles rotating at over 6,000 revolutions per minute, create yarns that balance strength and softness, preserving silk's natural drape and glossy sheen. In modern workshops, precision looms controlled by digital systems weave thousands of fibers into intricate fabrics. Each loom operates with millimeter accuracy, yet the spirit of craftsmanship remains unchanged. Whether woven by hand on bamboo frames or by robotic arms, every thread moves with the same purpose to capture light and life within fabric. For centuries, Chinese artisans have blended technology with tradition. From Suzhou's famous brocades to Hangzhou's shimmering satins, the weaving process is as much an art as it is an engineering marvel, each pattern, each movement of the shuttle, a tribute to human patience and creativity. Once woven, the silk undergoes degumming a purification process that removes the remaining saracen. Warm alkaline baths gently dissolve the natural gum, revealing a soft glass-like texture beneath. The threads are then rinsed and prepared for dyeing, the moment where silk truly comes alive. In both traditional workshops and modern dye houses, vats of steaming water blend natural pigments extracted from indigo pomegranate rosewood and other plants. As the silk soaks it, absorbs color like breathing in light. Depending on the technique, artisans may layer tones to create complex gradients or hand paint designs for brocade and ecot fabrics. When the threads dry, their surface reflects light in waves shimmering from gold to ivory, crimson to jade. Each hue carries the memory of earth plants and hands that shaped it. The result is more than fabric. It is living art, as soft as air, yet strong enough to endure generations. Behind every meter of silk lies a story of harmony between humans and insects, nature, and technology, patience, and precision. From the tiny silkworm feeding quietly on mulberry leaves to the glowing threads adorning luxury runways, silk represents more than beauty. It symbolizes how something so small, so fragile can connect centuries of civilization.
In an age, an age defined by synthetic fibers and artificial intelligence, silk remains a reminder that the most advanced creations often come from nature itself. It is not just a product of biology or industry, it is a masterpiece woven by life. And as each shimmering strand catches the light, we are reminded of a truth that has endured for 5,000 years. Real luxury is born from patience, respect, and the timeless art of transformation.